For twice now. Come. Come, come here. I don't even know about I'm it. Talking about it. Come here. Ah! Uche, what is it? My name is Eche Dala, not the witch. <laughs> oh! Is it because I scored 10 over 10 in mass? You boasted to everyone you are best in mathematics. And I proved you wrong. Man of man. You scored 10 out of 10 in mathematics simply because you're a witch. When you were getting 10 10 in maths, were you a wizard? I was not a wizard, but your mother is a witch. Did you just call my mother a witch? Your mother is a witch and a prostitute. That's why you have no father. Hey! Hey! You come up with a witch! Look at this! How dare you? How dare you? How dare you? You see, I'm not a witch. I'm not a witch. You see, I'm not a witch. You see, I'm not a witch. You're a witch. To leave her alone. God, but I don't know she's a witch now. Nah. She's not highly witch. She's a witch. But I told you, don't fight with him. I don't know she's a witch now. Nah. She's a witch. I don't know. Let's go. Let's go. Eche, how many times have I told you not to fight in school? Mama, 
Mama, he called me a witch. And called my mother a witch and a prostitute. Mama, why did they like say bad thing about me and my mother? He said I don't have a father. Mama, is that true? It is not true, my dear. Everybody has father. Or did you fall from the sky? Mama, I don't know. Mama, who is my father? We shall not talk that now. Huh? Now, listen to me. I don't want you fighting in school anymore. You are a woman. Go. Have your wash your uniform. Have your bath. Eat. Your food is in the kitchen. It's in that white place. Huh? Please. I love you. Why would people not leave my daughter alone? The circumstances concerning her death is nobody's lookout. What soul is that? Let me see that wish. That hope, that wretched breath. Negrem it! Negrem! Oh! You are here, Abby. Okay. Ah ah! Nengazi, what is it? Why are you shouting at me? Get for Abu. Negrem it! Your wish of your daughter! Want to kill my son for me? Look at my precious son. And the witch you have in your house want to kill him for me. Hey! Better control your mouth and train your children not to give other people's name. As in, did I say anything wrong? Oh? Is the mother of this your witch? Is she not a prostitute? And I want to ask you, do you know the father of this your witch daughter? Eh? Do you know her? Do you know the, her father? Oh, so you have the girl to come to my house to fight me, eh? What? Just let me just help and go. I don't want to go. go. You are not even talking of fights. Do they claim it? Please. Go, go, people go, go, should go. take my son to hospital. That is why I am here. Um, take my son to hospital. No. Oh. Um, Mama Dati, hold that she. Let me give your son just one book. Go, go, go. Please hold this for him. Please hold this for him. Mama, just hold your daughter. Hold your wish. You want to go? Mama, just hold your daughter. Hold your wish. You want to go? Mama, just hold your daughter. 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 Mama Ngozi, that is your cup of tea. If you cannot train your children and you cannot tell them how to talk to people, that is your business and not my own. I've told you, I've told you. If you can't control them, that is your business. I've trained my children and I've told them how to behave. So if you can't keep your own the way they ought to be, that is your headache and not my own. Eche? Yes, ma'am. Have you done your homework? Your mother did not tell me who your father is. How can you not know? They were not married and she didn't tell me. That means I'm a bastard. Don't say that ever again. Grandma, that's what everybody says. And that's what they call me in school. My dear, if you don't know your father, does not mean you don't have a father. Everybody has a father except Jesus. Grandma, Jesus has a father. The name of his father is Joseph the Capita. That is his adoptive father. Jesus does not have a biological father. Remember, his mother is Virgin Mary. And if Mary is a virgin, that means Jesus has no biological father. So, I'm like Jesus. No, you have a father. And you don't know that. I do. You Prove. have a father. Prove it. Mm. You can't, and I like it. 
don't worry, Grandma. Seeing Jesus did not mind not having a father. I don't mind either. That is super cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh! A gifted child. Glory. Carrying anything, my friend. Go back there and find something to carry. Eh? Stop walking about empty handed. Go and carry something. Stop being stupid. friend anymore. What did I do wrong? She doesn't want to be your friend anymore because you are a bad girl and you are different from all of us. Because I don't have a father. But Jesus did not have a father. Don't you know Jesus' father is Joseph, you dummy. If Joseph was Jesus' father, why was Mary a virgin? Ask your mother that. I don't care if I don't have a father because Jesus did not have a father. And he's a good person. Amaka, if you don't want to be my friend, don't worry. I don't need you. Go away. Leave that witch. Come on, let's go. Let's go leave the game. Oh, you're Let's fine. go. Are you okay? Yes. My friend, that girl don't day here since they cry. What did they do? They frog and for school. I be they never pay her school fees. Girl, yeah, I don't know. Take your bread and then eat. 
Oh, if I'm a cop, hmm? I don't come on, eh? Because I heard that you came back from the city to the village. I want to know exactly what happened. Because suddenly, we saw you. That is why I came with my fellow Etienne. Hmm? As you call it. It's a long story. Well, such is life. It's not a thing I'll start going into details. Let's leave for next time. Clement, is this you? I don't want to go Clement, what happened? Well, it's money problem. Oh, Diego. I ran out of cash. Yes, my business went comatose. And then the government policy was not helping my, my business. So I had to close shop and come back to the village. That's my problem. Mm -hmm. um, we understand. I know it's not easy. Hmm? Mm -hmm. We shall look for a solution eh? to raise you up out of this nonsense. It is not easy for you to go back. At least they are, they are, they are following all their children, colleagues, yeah? in the city. They come back with a car and the houses. Don't worry. Yeah? We are going to put her together in this our village to make sure you go back in a big way. Master Kole, mm. always count on you. Yes. <laughs> She did. Both of you will not bully on your sister. She's too young for that. Stephen and Blessing are your family. Your brother, your sister. All you need is to love them. Grandma. Grandma, they attacked me the first. This is what they did the last time they were here. But I'm bigger now. If they do me, I do them. One word. I don't think and I don't believe in that rule of do me, I do you. Anyway, I don't think things are okay with them. What do you mean? This is the middle of the time and they are here. And I feel they are angry because they came home. But what is there to be angry about? The village is cool and your grandma is super cool. cool. My precious too, you are super cool. All you need is to be patient. I have to make them to like me. That way, 
I don't have to go to Amaka's house so that her sister can teach me what I don't know. My own brother and sister can teach me now. Don't worry, Grandma. That is sparkle. Everything will be alright. If I give you blue. My precious. Yes, Grandma. What is it? Grandma, why not everyone hate me? That is not the truth. Grandma, that is true. Grandma, I'm a god said she don't want me to be her friend again. I'm letting her statement. They said they don't like me. And they're my family. I see. You want people to like you? Yes, Grandma. I want a family. You have a family? No, Grandma. You're the only one. Have you heard of the Golden Rule? The Golden Rule? Yes. No. What is it about? 
That is what Jesus said to his disciples. Go and get your Bible. Matthew chapter 7 verse 12 Abier. Therefore, all things whatsoever he would do that men should do to you, do he even so to them. For this is the law and the prophet. And what Jesus is saying there, and whatever you want others to do for you, you should do it to them. And he said, if you want people to like and love you, what are you going to do? I would like and love them first. This is super cool. Grandma, Jesus does not have a biology father like me, but yes, he's great. I want to be great like him. From today, I will follow his golden rule. And people will like me and love me. This is super cool. Grandma, I love you. And I love you too. My friend. You see? It is working. Yes, it's working. Super cool. No. I want him to say good things about me. So I will say good things to him first. How is your sister? She's very beautiful. What did you say now? I said your sister is very beautiful. Have a nice day. What is she doing? I want to beat her. I want to beat her. Uncle ice cream. Do not mind him, my dear. What happened today? Nothing. 
Nothing. That your uniform is dirty. Are you in a fight again today? No, Grandma. I fell. How will she feel if she finds out I lied? Actually, could she push me? I don't want to fight him, so I ran away. I wanted so much to beat him the way I beat him yesterday. I felt so powerful. I felt important. But today, I felt like a fool. And you are laughing at him. Why didn't you retaliate? I don't want to fight because my brother Jesus don't fight. Your brother? Yes, now, Jesus. He does not have any biology father like me. <laughs> Jesus Christ has a father. God is his father. God is everyone's father. That does not count it. How did Jesus feel when the people were laughing at him and hitting him? What did the Bible say? He did not retaliate. It wasn't easy for him, though. Grandma, Jesus is important. He has a purpose. Why did God create me? What is my purpose? What? I don't have a purpose. Everyone has a purpose. Then what is my purpose? God. How do I answer these questions? You see, you don't know. My precious, I don't have an answer to that question. Let will figure it out between two of us. Okay, Grandma. And why is this cream like a banshee? What is a banshee? It's a character from a movie. What movie? Oh, I think it's that girl stuff you watch, right? If you're feeling like a man, why are you here? Why are you not inside facing the beast like a man? <laughs> <laughs> I said it. I know you're hiding. But you don't have to hide, you know. I will show you. Yes, you're not spoiling them. I can't talk for them not to wait and listen to what I'm saying. They jump out of my house. Enough! What is enough? Stop shouting. How would I shout? What are you spoiling at? You're not spoiling this. You're the one spoiling them! You're not spoiling them! You're the one spoiling them! No, it's you! Oh, no, shout on top of your voice! You're not spoiling them as well. What is that? Yes, yeah, who is it? What is it? Oh, why are you always screaming? 
Is it your business? Yes, it is my business. It is? Yes, since my ear is still ringing, that means it is my business. Well, do you see Stephen and Blessing out there? Who is looking for them? Me, of course. Why? Because I'm their father. Men does not scream like women. Are you lecturing me? Am I? Yes. No. I feel like screaming. Stop it! Stop! It. Stop, it. Stop. <laughs> you see, it is not good to scream. <laughs> I don't blame you. I thought he was going to strike you. Were you not afraid? No. Maybe a little bit. But he's our father. You don't need to be afraid of him. I don't want a father. What do you even know about fathers? Or do you even have one? In fact, you're a bastard. I could bless. Yes. What did I know about fathers? Nothing. Good morning, sister. Blessing and brother Stephen. You know that, sister. Okay, cousin. But you know, Jesus Christ called his disciples brothers. You see, I'm right. You're my brother and sister. So annoying. I heard that. I wanted you, you to. You don't thank me for keeping your portion. I did not ask you to. Thank you. You're welcome. You're very, very crazy. <laughs> so, what are we going to do about that brat? The brat? Why do we need to do something about her? She's annoying, and I don't need a kid sister. Forget her. She's not important. Meanwhile, what did Chris say to you? Something like what? <laughs> did you like him? <laughs> Bless you. You know our state in the village is temporal. You shouldn't be thinking about any boy. And when the beast finds out you have a boyfriend, he will kill you. Boyfriend? I had that! What boyfriend? Who is the beast? Get out from here. I know what boy and what friend is. She not Chris is a boy. And he likes me. That means he's my boyfriend. What? Which Chris? Uh-uh. She's not Chris in Steven class. I saw him today talking to you in school. Does that mean I have a boyfriend? Hmm. Do you think grandma will approve it? By the way, who is the beast? Is it your father? Uh-uh. Should have called him that. Shut up! 
Du est peste Et peste Et peste Quoi que c'est peste Les teachers in school Peste and insect or animal That destroy plants or food No I'm not the best Good afternoon. Why are you going home alone? My brother and sister are busy. I don't want to wait for them. I know it has to do with senior class. I can't wait to be senior. Is it difficult? It seems senior Chris and sister blessing filled their mouth. Their father shouted and shouted. He wasn't only shouting, he screamed like a banshee. Banshee me. I know what a banshee is, Eche. You do? I thought you won't since you're a boy. <laughs> so, um, what do you mean? But as Steven said, he don't know what Banshee means because he's all this girly movie. <laughs> well, not everyone thinks like that. That means you're my boyfriend. What? You're a boy. I am my friend. That means you're my boyfriend. <laughs> well, if you put it like that, I guess so. Cool, super cool. I now have a boyfriend. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up your mouth. Don't say this to anyone. Why? You're my friend. I you a boy. You're my boyfriend. Oh. Are you a girl? Okay, okay. You know I'm a boy. You no problem. You won. I won. Grandma always says that. <laughs> <laughs> your grandma? Don't tell me more about your grandma. <laughs> Don't worry, he's my cousin. Just leave it. We'll do it as, as far as the cousin with Tilda. Why are you waiting? Are you waiting for me? Yes, to beat you. What is going on here? What is going on here? Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Senior, it was Nabi. I've been planning to deal with us in the class. So we have vowed that we will beat her here now. That is not true! She has been saying bad things about all of us. That is not true either! For us to settle this matter, we want to fight Amaka. Yes! Come and fight me. I cannot fight Amaka. Amaka is my best friend. I am not your friend. Stop it. 
I want you guys to take your things and leave this place this minute. Amaka, Faith, you heard what I said. Carry your friends and leave this place this minute. Now! Go now! Why did they hit me? Don't mind them, my angel. Eh? They're just being kids. What are they kids? Uh, I know. And kids do naughty things. Not me. Especially you. Eh? Especially you. Eh? Or you think I didn't know where you put gum on, on your basic for teacher's chair? That when she stood up like this, it's just spark on her bum bum. <laughs> that another teacher had to come and remove it. Eh? That's how not you are. But I was lit to death and she always sleeps. You see? <laughs> so whenever teacher sleep now, you do naughty things, Abby. Let's go, don't worry. You do naughty things whenever you sleep, Abby. No! Eh? I don't the next time you put it on my chair. <laughs> Uchi, yeah. why is it that each is always talking to that senior? Just don't worry. A day will come that senior will not build that gate. I must make sure that I deal with that gate that day. I must sure I deal with her. It is always always talking to that senior, and the senior have not spoken to any of us. For me, I don't know. Why would you not know? Don't know she has bewitched that senior. I don't believe it. Why wouldn't you believe that thing? My mom, my mom told me that it is nice a witch. And we have to do good by avoiding her, or else our cause will follow us. What cause? Mm, I don't know. Well, that was my mom said that we have to avoid her. Because the cause, we have to avoid her. If that's the case, I'll never talk to her again. So what of the Amaka? Will you talk to her? I will not talk to her too. Okay now. Blessing, what are you doing? Eh? Nothing, Mom. You are doing nothing. Eh, Blessing? Instead of you to read your books, you are here playing game. Will you get inside the house and read your book? I don't want your father to come back and start screaming. Mom, we've been studying in school since morning. We need a break. You know what they say? All works and no play makes blessing a dull chick. <laughs> so, blessing. Me, your mother, is what you are saying. Oh, look at your face. Look at your mouth. Eh? See, H.S. Lam. Did she not the same school with you? Look at her. She reads her books, always with her book. Mom, how can you compare your children with that thing? Hmm. And so? And what about that? Eh? It is that she is your cousin. Very intelligent girl. Such a smart girl. Ah, Blexi. Get inside and read your books. Mom. Her father is a monster, a rapist. What? What did he just said? Her father is a monster. Or oh, her. Just get her from that place. Get up and go and read your books. And by the way, where is your brother? I don't know. You don't know? Go and find him. I want both of you to go and read your books. Is that clear? I don't want to come out here and see you here again. Nonsense. Someone will not raise in this house. Every time, bless him. Go and read your book. Go and read your book. I'm tired though.
a blessing. Hmm? I can't believe mom compared us with that thing. Hmm. Hmm. I was so shocked. You have to punish her for that. Yes. I have an idea. See, she's so good. She should be doing all our housework. Washing of plates. Cooking. Washing of clothes. In fact, she should start now. Hey brat, I want you to wash my clothes for me right now. I'm busy. I am not asking you. I know, but let me finish my assignment first then I'll come wash it. Now! Blessing, what is it? I can't do now, what's the problem? Grandma. Auntie Blaze is saying I should help her wash her clothes. But I told her I'm busy. She said she wants it now. Where are you going? But I'm going to wash it. Sit down and do your homework. But Grandma... Don't Grandma me a kid, Sit and do your homework. Blessing, leave this girl alone. You can do your washing by yourself. You have your hands. On us. That is true. But we can always punish that brat. Exactly. I know what to do. Hey. 
Tesla. You are telling me that this cloth wants itself. But I don't know. I was already born when I came. Man, you need to believe me. Truth, you need to believe me. Yes. You will. You evil child. Believe you. You evil child. You evil child. You evil child. Ah! Me and Eki has been in this house, we've been washing and ironing clothes, and not for one day has she done any of my clothes. Next time you find out what really happened before you start beating her. Grandma, I did not. Grandma, don't ask, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. She's evil. She's evil. You can't do anything. Leave her alone. Grandma, it's already funny when I came. You this little witch! You pay for this! Do not touch her or else I will make you pay! Lisa, Lisa, let's go! Mama! I find that my this money, they need to believe me! I know! Don't let that bother you! I will take care of you! But Grandma, why do they hate you? They don't hate you. You are the sweetest and kindest person I know. Yes, they do hate me. They don't hate you. I think they are angry because of their situation. But it's not my fault that in the village. And the village is not so bad. I know it is not your fault. But sometimes people take their frustration on others. So don't let it bother you, my dear. Okay, Grandma. <laughs> I think I know what to do. You say that I'm sweeter than Kyle's Yeah. Or maybe I'm like you. You will see. Yeah. I know you can do it. Sister, bless you. I'm sorry. How can you say you are sorry and I know you are still lying? I'm not lying. I am not the one that burned your clothes. Then you are not sorry. But I'm sorry. Either you accept you burned my clothes, then I can accept your apology. Or you are lying by saying you are sorry. I'm not the one that burned your clothes. But I'm telling you sorry because your clothes were set on fire. Then you are not making sense. I am making sense. This is simple logic. Get out! Go now! You know you are supposed to be nice to me because I'm nice to you. That's how it works. Sorry, I'm sorry. What rubbish. Ma, the way H is gonna burnt my daughter's clothes, I don't like it at all. Do you come Ma? Ma, don't be annoyed, please. I'm confused. I don't know how it really happened. But I will see and know what to do about it. Please don't be annoyed. You know the circumstances surrounding her. But please don't be annoyed. The next please. time she would try it, the next time she tried to do any nonsense with my children's clothes. Mpechaya. Hey, mom. If please. I flog her, her ah, skin will peel. Please, please, please don't do it. Please. Please, please, please don't do it. Please. Please. You know the circumstances surrounding her bed. Please. And so, out of that concern me. Please. Her skin will peel. Please, please, please. 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 Look at you. Walking out on me. Oh. You didn't give me Oh. Hey, Che. Hey, Che. Oh. But people should come here. Eh? People will not give me this. Now. Uh, let, me, okay. let me let me deal with you. Let me deal with you. Let me deal with you. It's okay. It's okay now. Uh, 
and, and even you, even you, I work every day, day and night, so you people can eat. Only for me to come back looking hungry and tired. And what will my mother do to welcome me back? Eh? To start complaining about that little girl? Tell me about her school fees and everything, that he even bought your clothes? Tell me, what have I sacrificed my people? Because of you, I'm in this village. I would have been abroad in USA. I would have been there. But no, I'm in this village. And what do you people used to appreciate all our different people? Nothing. But you people just being foolish, useless, and such. Enough! Ah! You just came back and being so angry. It's not good for your health. Not good for my health. See, if I fall down here and die, it is people's fault. Yes! And my woman will not allow you to go scot free. I think you all know that. Sweetheart, it's okay now. Calm down. I have prepared a special dish. You love it now. Eh, you know now. Eh? I'm putting water for you to go and take a bath. It's not for me to go and take any bath. I'm hungry. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come. You will eat. Come, 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 Worry yourself. I will slap her like this. I will slap her. Let her go. See, let me tell you, I'll make you pay for everything you make us pass you. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, please. Shut up! <laughs> Pretender, you will suffer. I'm sorry I got in trouble. I just wanted them to like you. They like? Which like? See? Switch you only to. Darling, I know you are angry because the way Mama talked to you, you don't like it. Mama shouldn't have done that. Sweetheart. Are you saying that Mama is wrong? No, but she misunderstood us. It's just like your, your niece, both bless his clothes. What should I do? To laugh at her or to clap for her? Hmm? I disciplined her. So, did you tell Mama what Echazuna did? I tried to explain, but she wouldn't listen. I must confess. I disciplined her in anger. That was what made Mama to be angry with us. That little girl. H is in her. She was very lucky I was not around. I would have given her the bruises that she would never forget in her life. When she looked at her skin, she would remember that, yes, I, Clement, did it to her. It's okay. Well, I'm it's sorry okay. I lost my temper. <laughs> huh? It's okay, it's okay, sweetheart. It's okay, my love. She said, me for Hey, you, you, come here. 
What did you do? I did nothing. You said nothing? Eh? <laughs> See, eh? If you are supposed to cause trouble again in this compound, I, I, I will squash you. How can you squash me? I'm not a mosquito. What? Are you challenging me? No, you only squash is just like mosquito. Like, but I'm a big girl. I'm a woman, but you can't squash me. What? What? <laughs> what? Will you shut up? Shut up! Shut up! The next time you cause trouble again in this compound, it's what I do to you. Come on. Ah, always causing trouble in the compound. Talk to him. Talk to him first. No. no. He will scream at us. Scream? He is your father. Your mother. Yes, I know I am your mother. But it is your duty to tell your father about your school fees. Oh, but. There is no but. Talk to him first. I will talk to him later. But mom, you don't know what is going to change once you come to this village. But it's getting worse. I hate this village. <sighs> I hate it too. But this is what we have right now. We make do of what we have. Nobody likes it. I just want to go back to the city. Me too. Mom, don't go to the city too. You finished early. You don't need to rush home. So, um, what do you mean by um, spend some time together? You don't know what I'm talking about. I mean, take a stroll, walk. Sit and talk, get to know me, and also know you too. Thanks. Thank you. I pass. What did she tell you about me? Who? The brat, of course. She told you something that is why you refuse to, to hang out with me. 
Did she tell you I took her back? I didn't mean it. I just want to teach her a lesson. So you took her back? Hmm. So you were the reason we couldn't study, right? Did she tell you? Damn! I did not actually took her back. I was... Don't worry. You know what? I was actually thinking that maybe this time will be the best time for both of us to hang out together. Like in school or somewhere else. But... You're just a kid. I am not a child! You are just being childish. You are selfish and wicked. I don't want to hang out with people like you. Except when it comes to um, studies or academic affairs. But hmm, it seems to me that you are not in that category. So please. Chris! Chris, please come! It is that brat's fault! I will teach her a lesson! And she will be! I'm not going to give it to you until you cry. Cry? For what? In fact, I'm not crying. Then I'm not giving you your bag. Please now. I want to study. Do what I ask you to do and I'll give you your bag. Ah. What are you doing? If you don't give me my scuba again, I will smash this thing. You wouldn't dare. I wouldn't dare. I wouldn't dare, Chef. Don't worry. What I say, I'll break this thing, eh? Then I will go inside and tell Grandma that you have been with my scuba bag since yesterday. Then Grandma will tell you to give me my scuba bag. And you see, your game is gone! I I'll just kill you. You see, if, if you come home, I, I will smash it. Give me my scuba bag. Okay, let's give it back. Okay, wait, wait. Listen, give her a bag. Just give her a bag. What? You don't mean to let her win? Eh, yeah, win. One! Wait, 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 wait. 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 Give her a bag. Two! I'll, I'll try to! Wait, wait, wait. Uh, okay, now. Three! What? No, don't, don't, don't break it. Wait, just wait. Five. Hey, take it. Hmm. I'm a fool. No, I'm a fool now. I'm, I'm stupid. You want me to go there? Hmm. So when I go there, you now hold me like this, eh? 
He now dunk me. Take the game and I scream and go. I will not come. I will not come. Oh yeah, shift. Shift now. Shift now. Hey. Shift now. Have something to say? Say it now and stop fidgeting. Okay. Okay. Uncle Clement, why do you like to scream? You scream like a banshee, you know. And it is not good for your health. It makes you sick. Grandma say it causes heart attack. Yes. And you want to die? No. I don't want you to die too. And you will make Stephen a blessing afraid. They don't want you to die either. Because when they die, they would have a father. And you know how it feels when you don't have a father. Spending your evening with that child, and he told me you are not responsible for. Oh, Linda, can you hear now? Eh? What is it? Eh? I have told you several times, times without number, that I am not responsible for the rape of my of my sister. I didn't rape anyone, eh? and I didn't force any woman to sleep with me. Can you hear Eh? Besides. I'm married to you. How can you know? But the people that raped your sister said that she raped a woman. Eh? I don't know where this story is coming from. Oh. I'm not going to go quiet, I don't even know who they are even talking about. I believed you. But I don't know what to believe again. You see? I know you don't believe me. You never did. You never did. I stayed with you. You have been punishing me. Yes. With, through, through your attitude and every other character you've been showing me in this house. You have been punishing me. You've been punishing me for a crime I did not commit. For 18, I know nothing about. You've been punishing me. So bad, you know. But there's no problem about that. As for me, speaking with uh, 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 let me tell you, she's my sister's daughter. She's my niece. Our blood flows in her veins. And there's nothing anybody can do to change that. Do you understand me? Even if it is monsters that raped her mother, no problem. Our blood flows in her veins. And there's nothing anybody can do to change that. Not even you. Do you understand me? Clement, mm -hmm. what is the meaning of this? Huh? <laughs> nothing. Nothing. Oh, Jim. 
Oh, what time she just for? Friends, you know. I don't want to be your friend. You are not my type. So, you are friend to that brat. See that girl. Her name is Echazona, and she's worth thousands of you. <laughs> Eche, Maka, how are you doing? Fine, Chris. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Senior Chris, can you believe that Amaka scored 8 and I scored 10 again? Again? Yes. That's very good. Yes, thank you. Hmm, you are welcome. Why is it that when people say thank you, people say you're welcome? Well, I don't know. Mm. But um, I think it's a way to show that they've accepted the appreciation. Mm. Mm. I like that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we are going. What? Eche? I can't believe you are blowing me off because of Amaka. I don't understand. I was just waiting for you. But I have something to tell Amaka. She's my super friend, you know. Mm -hmm. By the way, Sister Blessing is here to keep you company. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Well? I guess I'll go alongside you after all. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> She's a brat. Hi. Yeah, she is. You are crying, you are telling me nothing. Hmm? That brat said something to me. So, you are crying because of what a child said to you. Ah, blessing. I am not crying because of what she said. Because what she said is true. She said. She said you spoiled us. That she would not be an offer to the kind of our family. She said I spoiled you. And you believed her. Our black thing. You are crazy. You are crazy. <laughs> Rats. I'm going to kill her. I'm going to deal with her. She is a witch. Let me go and come back.
Tito. Am I behaving like a kid? I cannot lie against that brat. I hate her. She's making me behave like a child. What did I do? Angela! Give me your hand! But what did I do? If you do not give me your hand, I'm going to flop all, all over your body! <laughs> give me your hand! Please <laughs> don't run and stop! Don't do it again! What did you tell my daughter? Nothing. Nothing. I'm tired of loving them first. What am I not mean? For instance, if I'm mean, I would tell everyone in school that their father is not so rich as they claim to be. And their family is not so cool as they pretend it to be. They say their father is great. And yet, they call him the beast! Eh? What kind of cause did I even have? So me. Oh, yeah. Let's just What are you murmuring about? Grandma. Grandma. I don't want to be nice anymore. Hey! 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 Hey!
Why don't you go back home? Your sister blessing you see me up. But both of us can escort you. Yes, I know, darling, but um there is something I need to tell your sister blessing and it is super secret. Not for kids like you, you know. Okay. I don't want to hear adults talk. Exactly. <laughs> see you in school tomorrow. Alright. Bye bye. Be careful though. Hey. Hi. Now you're behaving yourself. Finally caught you. Caught me how? You had me well. Mama, what do you want from us? It's you that we answer that question. I said, what did you want from us, Mama? Explain yourself. <laughs> Mama, I know what you are telling that girl. That I am a bad mother. Mm -hmm. I did not train them very well. Mm -hmm. Mama, what is your business? Mm -hmm. You are looking for my trouble. Ah. ah, Mama. Since he came back, I have been on my own. Mm -hmm. I don't look for your trouble. Mm -hmm. Mama, leave us alone. For goodness sake, what is your business? If I and my family eat millions of uh, meat, eh? what is your business, Mama? Mama, mind your business. Mind your business. Leave us alone. I've warned you. I have warned you, Mama. you. Shame on you, Linda. It is because of your church and extravagant life that made my son and his children to be living in the village. Did it bother you? No. Do you care how they are surviving? No. Huh? All you do is to sleep, wake up, eat, go to the boutique and market, buy extravagant wares for you and your children. Very soon send your husband to his early grave. Then I will see where you will get money to spend. Shame on you. Mama, I'm warning you. Mm, I'm warning you, Mama. I'm not respecting your old age. You are looking for my trouble. You cannot do me anything. I will continue to Leave stay. us alone. Don't matter, Mama. Mama, not my Mama, not my daughter. You cannot do me anything. You cannot do me anything. Leave my family alone. Your church are trying to do I'm not respecting your old age. Church are trying to do what? Church are trying to do what? You can keep this attack to yourself. I don't want to know. You're trying to show your child. It's too much. Leave my boy on alone. Behave well. If you don't behave well, I can't be talking to you. Try to try it too much. Everyone will be gone. Mama, that's your child. Hey, that's it. Mama, that's your child, Mama. Try to try it too much. Half a one. Half a one. Tell me that my child is in school today. So the two of us, eh, we are going to beat each other, and you tell them that I'm doing no better. Shut up. Everybody already knows she can beat you. So we tell them that I was the one who beat her. I know, I know. But I need to defeat her. So people will stop calling me names. It's humiliating. Even in school today, self, that she scored 10 over, 10 over 10. The master gave her cane to flog each and every one of us, depending on what we feel. Thank God I'm not in your class, so. She's coming, she's coming, she's coming. Okay, 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 okay. I see. You're waiting for me to beat you up again, right? <laughs> we are not two. We are not two. 
We will beat you. You cannot beat us again. Yes, today you'll be the one eating sand. Yeah, are you sure? I'm... Ah! Mm. You're putting your clothes. I'm, I'm, your clothes. I'm, I'm, joking. I'm, I'm joking with you. You put your clothes here. Let me see. <laughs> you are now. Now we are not two. No, good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Afternoon. What is going on here? Nothing. I say we interrupted the fight. Mm -hmm. Hey, why are you walking away? Don't tell me you're a coward. I am not a coward. I simply don't fight. Ha! You fight always. Yes, you always fight. I express my kid sister to show her smartness, at least to fight, and not be called a coward. I have told you, I am not a coward. So you're the one that encouraged Faith and Uche to attack and beat up your sister, right? That is not true. That brat lied to you. If I lied to you. Well, it was Faith that told me everything that happened. She's my cousin, you remember? Hmm. But, Blessing, what is wrong with you? Huh? How could, how could it be this wicked? Huh? Because she's not your sister, right? But let me tell you something. She's your cousin. Does that mean anything to you? Huh? Chris. Chris. She's just a baby. Blessing. Why do you, why do you hate her so much? Why? I am sorry. You are sorry? Huh? Obviously, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. 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 Blessing, get your hands off me now. No! I am no! sorry. No! Please. Please. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Hey. Hey, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
How is school today? Give me some. Mm -hmm. Are you alright? Mm. Hmm? Are you sure? Yes. Um, Eche, yeah, you know I love my children so much. That's why I provide everything for them. Okay. Um, are, are you angry with me? No, I'm angry with you. Um. Do you think I'm a bad father the way I treat my children? No, and it's not my, of my business. I don't have a father. Neither do I have a mother. Except from grandma, who loves me so much. So I don't even know how family looks like. Mm, well, um, Echa, I know you always dream of your family of your own. So tell me, what kind of family are you dreaming about? For me now. Uh, <laughs> Snow Chris, good evening. I have been waiting for you. I want to tell you something. Eche, what is it? Are you okay? Yes. But your books are not with you. Are you not ready for lesson? I don't want to learn again. In fact, I don't want it to help you. What? Don't. Did the blessing tell you anything? No. I don't want to learn again. Which means I don't want to pass the scholarship. <laughs> of course you don't mean that. I mean it. Then who will pay your school fees? It doesn't matter who will pay it. Oh, uh, a chair. Um, okay, okay, all right. Why don't you just tell me about the story of, you know, Sonia and how she relates with her step-siblings in your story. You know, how far has she gone? Has she conquered the beast? I don't want to write the story anymore. That story is very stupid. It's... Are you leaving? Are you not teaching her today? Hi. She has a name, you know. But you are feeling so pompous, so elegant to call her by her name. You hate her so much, you can't even call her by her name. It is brat, 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 brat all the time. Or sometimes you don't even give her name at all. Well, you won this time, Nabi. Congratulations. I don't understand. I she does not want to learn now. 
she does not want to win the scholarship anymore. So you should be happy. It was every this is exactly what you wanted, Okwaya. Please. What did I do? What did I do? Come to school today. Nothing. Were you sick? No. Oh, you have never missed school. Even when you are sick. I don't want to go to school again. Why? Nothing. Ichi, I'm your friend. Tell me. Nothing is wrong, Amaka. You know you're not like me. You have a family and I don't. You have a family too. They are not my family. How will you say a thing like that? Hmm? You're my friend. I need you. If you don't come to school, then Uche and fail to be mean to me. Then stop going to school. You can come to my house every day. I will play. You must not study every time. No, me, I want to go to school. Then go! Fine. I don't need you. I'll be fine on my own. Eche, yes, anytime I see you with this boss thinking, it seems you want to fight again in school. No, Grandma. I don't even want to go to school anymore. Eh? We can talk about it later. Okay, Grandma. What are you doing here? I told you I don't want to study anymore. Um, I came to give you this. It's the story about Jesus. I've read it. You said you wanted to be like him. That he is your brother. Hey, when Jesus was in this world, did anybody like him? No. They hated him, yet he didn't give up the way you are giving up now. No, he died to save us. Think about it, Echesada. What if you are the one to make the beast stop screaming and you give up? Does it mean that the beast and the children will not live together? I've told you times with that number. That story is very stupid. Hmm? It is not. It is the story of your family. What will happen to your family when you give up? They will never be happy, ever. It's not my business. Must I be the one to make them live happy ever after? What no! If, what if you are the one to do that and you give up? Then the beast and the children will not live happily ever after. Huh? Think about Sonia. Think about Sonia. You really not give up, right? I have to save them. Yes. Yes. This is a Marco! Thank you! <laughs> Subaku! Well, I've done my beat. Tell me that you don't have the money I ask you. Linda, I don't have money now. What? Mbamba, I need that money. 
Belinda. You spent too much. In the for you too much. Huh? You can't stay one day without talking about money. Okay, do. How do you expect me to get back on my feet if you continue like this? Huh? Hmm. Like what? When you talk about money, 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 money all the time. Okay, do. Huh? I'm in the medical. The day is born, you have born money. What's the problem? I knew it. Knew what? I knew it. I know there's that woman. Eh? When she leaves us alone, since she is in this house with us, eh? she will do everything at her own power to separate us. But I will not let her be. Uh-uh. I'm going to go see another one with this house. I'm going to go Yeah, Linda. 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 What are you doing now? What are you doing now? I can't believe that you are blaming my mother. Huh? What's wrong with you? I can't believe you are blaming my mother. She is the one telling you not to be giving me money. Ah. Ah. Okay. I will change it for her. I'm going to go see her and carry. Ah. Okay. I got funny. We shall see. No, wahala. What are you looking at? You. Me? Yes. But I did not scream. But you shouted. I was angry. But that's none of your business. It's my business. Because you're my family. And I love you. I want to make everyone happy. I want Aunt Linda to be happy and I want Stephen and Blessing to be happy. I want everyone to be one big family. You do? Yes, I do. But what shall I do? Yes, go inside. Open your Bible. I read Matthew 7 verse 12. Matthew Chapter 7, verse 12. Yes, Matthew 7, verse 12. It is the golden rule. Read it, follow it, and to teach you the way. Matthew chapter 7, verse 12. Can you go here? You are smoking. I will death for you. Get out. Hey, oh, I get out. Don't worry. I'm <laughs> See, see, see. I'm not smoking again. Mm. So, why are you smoking? Nothing. Eh, hey, nothing, kwa. Don't worry. You will see, see nothing. Not tell me. Why are you smoking? He's my father. Your father? But you used to call him the beast. He makes me angry. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'm not there. But go inside, eh? Open your Bible and read Matthew 7, verse 12. Yeah? You yeah? I thought you said you would not come back anymore. Hmm. How will I not come back to school when I want to be the first in class? 
By the way, how will I be the first female president in Nigeria if I do not go to school? Hmm? I know you'll come back. I'm so glad too. Come on, let's go. I don't want to go to school late on my first day back to school. Um, Linda, I'm sorry, darling. There's something I want us to discuss. About what? About us. About our family. What about our family? I know we used to be very happy. Is it my fault that we are like this? Um, Linda, I know you never believed me. Huh? I never raped anyone. I never did. I, it wasn't because of me that my sister was raped. And her life almost destroyed. Oh, God. That's I wish... I wish I had known who raped my sister. And almost tried to destroy her life. But your sister... She is happily married. Huh? I know she's happily married. I know. But... You know... We almost lost her then. When this thing happened, the trauma she went through was too much. We thought we were going to lose her. At least I should have found out who raped my sister and almost destroyed her life. Darling, please, stop punishing me. Stop punishing us. Huh? Please. Huh? I never raped anyone. I wish I have known who raped my sister. I would have punished that person so much. And H is a great kid. You think so? Yeah. She might be opinionated and a parrot, but she has a good heart. Huh? See, my sister is she's she's fine. Mama is fine. And H is too, she's fine. But we are not happy. And because of that, our children too are not happy. Please, I don't want to fight again. Eh? I don't want to be fighting all the time. I missed your support. <laughs> I know you're my uncle. Huh? And you're the reason why I was where I was. I love you, honey. I miss you. I love you. I love you. You see, you know what? Huh? I think now we should be a team again. Yes. We should pick up the pieces of our lives and rebuild this home. <laughs> Lily. 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 You want to eat me? You better go inside and start reading your book. Can Mr. Chia say he wants to see your assignment first thing tomorrow morning on his desk? What's wrong with you? Nothing is wrong with me. Oh. I don't understand you. Oh, just relax yourself, okay? My chemistry assignment will soon be ready. If you have paid Andrew to do that for you, 
you better go back and collect your money because I will report you to the teacher. Then I will tell dad. Are you mad? I know my brother and I know the capability of his brain. Dad has worked so hard and the least we can do is to read our books, pass our texts and exams. You better go and read your book. Look at the way she's standing like that, brat. Welcome, Mom. Wow, what happened? Like what, Mom? See everywhere, from outside, very clean. No single date. <sighs> Mom, you don't have to worry. We know you'll be very tired when you come back. That's why you have to do it. Wow, that's good. <laughs> See, I went out looking for a job. The only job that is available in town is teaching job. <laughs> really? Yes. That's great, Mom. You're a great teacher. And I know you when you start teaching again. Wow! Thank you, my daughter, for reminding me. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. See, your school is the best in town. I hope you wouldn't mind me looking for a job in your school. What? <laughs> wow, Mom. That would be great. You know, you don't need to worry about our test because, and I have my own test. And he's sitting at his own place too. Hmm, I'm so much impressed. How did he get the money? Don't worry, Mom. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm so much impressed. <laughs> yeah. Where are you going? Sorry, I was mean to my cousin. Will you forgive me? You should ask her for forgiveness. I will. Please, will you come and start teaching her again? Why don't you teach her? Hmm? She wants to. She wants me to. She wants me to, because she knows her brother and sister could not do the job. Is that what you think? I think so. Haven't you really figured out what she wants? No. You know both of you want the same thing. You don't know what I want. HS said you might get what you want. What I want? What do I want? What does that brat, I mean each is now, what does she want? The village is so cold. 
and I promise to be the best kid sister ever. Don't worry, you will like it. What are you reading? You know my name? <laughs> of course! How can I not know the name of my kid sister? Mm. Are you sure you're not telling me all this thing to trick me so I'll help you and do something difficult? <laughs> no. You are my sister. A chasener. The smartest one ever. You know, I'm so sorry. We have been mean to you. Will you forgive us? Please. I love you! <laughs> I know. And I love you too. No, no, no! Super cool! Wow! <laughs> what were you reading? Is this something I can help you out with? Yes. It's something I don't understand. I wanted to show it to Chris tomorrow at school. Uh, if my kid sister wants to win the scholarship, then I have to make sure she's the best. No. Oh, okay. Let's go. Then. Ah, Stephen, I'm not dressed in it. Go to your seat. Good. Um, your mother and I we been deliberating. And um, we want to appreciate you two for being patient with us. We know it is not easy for you to adjust to this village life. We we'll commend you two. Life has not been easy. Things have been very, very difficult. But all the same, we have been able to, to manage. So, Honey, if you have had it from your father, huh? there is no problem. Things will be okay. Huh? Thank you for your pleasure. <laughs> okay, things will be very, very okay. Uh, we are going to cut down on a lot of um, costs. Alright? No more uh, spending on frivolities. I'm going to make sure that we save more money now to take care of your education, your food, you know, clothing, you know, even on your medical um, health. So like this, we can be able to manage ourselves very well. Is that okay? Hope you're happy with that. Yes, we're happy. Dear brother, are you not happy? Yes, I'm okay. You're okay with that? Yes, sir. <laughs> so come, come my darling daughter, come. <laughs> mm. Mom. Mom, what of me now? 
Hmm. Hey, big boy, now nah. you two need a hug. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm happy at least we're now one big and happy family again. Mm hmm? It's very good. Um, you're welcome. I'm going to have to come see you. Alright. I'm going to tell you, but you won't eat it alone. That's my mommy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Darling, there is something which has been bothering me since. Hmm. What is it? See, your sister Evelyn, she's married. I don't know why she don't acknowledge, acknowledge her own daughter, her own child, for goodness hmm. sake. Hmm? I know that what happened to her has been in the past. I feel for her. I know what she has passed through. But that will not stop her not to ask of her daughter. Not to come and look for her daughter in the house either. She don't ask of her. Rather she pretend as if she's dead while she's alive. Hmm. Sure. For me, I don't approve of my sister's choice of not coming to visit us. Or pretending to be dead while she's alive. I don't approve of this. So, look at her daughter. It's just a She's a very good kid. Well, let's have my visitor. I found the empty. See, it's better for us to tell each other that her mother, she is alive. Huh? Let's have know whom her mother is. I search. How are you tell that kid that Amanda is alive? We don't even imagine the psychological trauma she will go through. I want to tell her that Amanda is alive. Just leave her the way she's happy. She's not even thinking about it at all. If you tell her now, be ready for the psychological trauma she's going to go through. Will you be there to carry it? Or can you bear it? Get 
Sonia est ma soeur absente. Je m'en vais une absente. Clement, my son. Hey, Mama. Linda, my wife. Linda. I'm so happy for the love and peace that is reigning in your family. All this while you and your husband and children have been fighting, have not been happy. But now that God has restored that peace and love in the family, I'm so happy. Money is not everything. Whether you see to it or not, once that love is there, everything will take place. And I'm so happy that as God has restored that love, into your family and continue to be so in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Mama. <laughs> Mama, thank oh, you so thank much. You so much. Eh? Thank you, my son. You've always been there to support us. At least even your mother support. Eh? Mama, thank you so much. Thank you, my eh? son. Well, Mama, you see, we'll be going back to the city in two days' time. Oh, of course. <laughs> I thank you very much, Ekene Yes, Mama. We'll be going back Oh, very happy, Mama. I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah, my friend um, raised some amount of money for us to go back to the city. Same with her 50,000. Oh, my daughter, I'm so happy. I'm happy, I'm so happy, yeah. Mama. Yeah. But that, mm -hmm. you know, it is you know, cash that continues to come. Yeah, really? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Want to come with us? Yes. I want to come with you. It's a blessing of God that's speaking. <laughs> Mama, hi. Mama, oh. Evelyn. Hi. You are welcome. Oh, my dear, you are welcome. How have you been? Fine. How is the city? Oh, and how is everything? Fine. You are welcome. Fine. Brother, you are in the village. Evelyn. With your family. Yes, we'll be here for a while. Maybe. Hey, Chesana. Yes, This is your mother. My mother? Yes. So, I am not a bastard. Not at all. Super cool! <laughs> my mother, then where is my father? <laughs> <laughs> 